Before enamel took off as a technique and an art form, it existed solely as a material. Put simply, let us say the three basic elements are glass frit, borax, and metallic oxide, which adds the colour. Vitrification is achieved by a combination of several chemical elements, silica in the form of sand, potash, soda and lead, heated in a crucible for several hours, like they do here at the crystal manufacturers of St Paul, near Limoges. Enamel is divided into several categories. Fluxes, enameling on a metal base, transparents, opaques and opals, each category having its own range of colours. The most common base for enamel is a metal, gold, silver or bronze, and, particularly today, copper. The fixing of the enamel onto its metal base requires the use of fire. It is the method used for applying the enamel powder to the metal that distinguishes the different technical principles. Champlevé, where hollows are made in the metal. Cloisonné, where the enamel is separated by partitions made of gold or silver painted enamel, and finally, although the least common, the plique à jour, which resembles stained glass.